There is definitely not a one size fits all approach when it comes to depression. I think it's very personal. And I think that just trying to encourage someone to kind of get out of their funk, that's really not um, the way that I would, I would go. I would approach a student who asked about that with a try to tune in to how you feel before and after your practice. Try to tune out all that chatter and when you're in class, try to just tune into your breath. A mantra I find is helpful. Recently, I had a student who talked about how beautiful she felt when she woke up that morning. And so we use that in class. As you inhale, think the words I am. As you exhale, think the word beautiful. And there was such a calming sense in that class afterwards. And no one really commented on it, but you could see it on their faces. And so I would encourage somebody who might be struggling with depression to try to listen to themselves before and after the class. And then maybe try a mantra, only one that felt comfortable though. I think in our culture it's really easy to feel like we're not beautiful. And there's so much that's kind of thrown at us. Being able to look within and feel within is where I think we find our strength and beauty. And when you can see that in yourself, you can see that in others. And that kind of a philosophy in the practice, in the studio, in the community, helps us to see it so much more in others and in what we do and in how we move.